Cancer. Welcome to another love reading of yours. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And of course time is fluid. You could have dealt with this energy or we'll be dealing with in the near future. What else? Um, some of the energies of the Cancer can be flipped. So feel free to switch those energies by versa. And if you do need a personal reading, all that information is going to be down below. Wow, Cancer, you have a brand new beginning. This is stability, security, commitment. Could be a new financial beginning, but because I'm not going to do a love reading, so I'm going to read this as a commitment, okay? Either the relationship that you are in, it's reaching a high level of commitment, or this is just a brand new beginning in a relationship, or this is just a commitment coming in, all right? That's awesome, that's awesome. This is a gift from the universe. This is your manifestation coming through love that right now you're releasing a load there has been this is a very draining energy that you're going through right now and there's something that you're like almost like fed up with okay it's like you're being overburdened and overwhelmed with the situation and you're just laying off the situation okay you're ready to drop the load what's influencing this is that you're feeling like a victim either you're feeling like a victim or you're just feeling very backstabbed and betrayed by someone or you, this is someone who's feeling like that because of you okay but you're ready to let a situation go that has made you feel a lot of hurt again the end of sorts is like overkill but more than overkill i'm getting a lot of over exhaustion okay the situation that you are in the ten of wands and the ten of swords okay it's like the end of the road buddy that's the end of the road this is it but you say, you know what, this is it. I cannot do this anymore. I'm letting this go, okay? This is not my load and not my burden to carry. And I'm ready to let this go. So yeah, you've released a burden. You've released a situation that was being too heavy on you, okay? And why? Because this is exhausting you. You feel like a victim or you were just feeling very backstabbed and betrayed, cheated, lied to, okay, in the situation. Otherwise, I'm just getting a lot of overkill is what I'm hearing again and again, okay? It was like getting too much for you. In the past, there could have been a wish fulfillment, okay, there could have been a wish that came through, there could have been a lot of emotional happiness around this situation, okay, you could have made someone happy, someone could have made you happy, but there's something that made you very, very happy, okay, it could be a little smug energy, okay, or maybe like you just pursued something that made you happy. On your mind is the Queen of Wands, either you're dealing with someone who you're very, very passionate about, who you're very, very attracted to, or this is just you who's feeling very passionate and your mojo's back and um, you feel like, you know, I'm going to do what makes me happy. I know what I want and I'm going to go for it. I'm just getting a lot of, whoa, this burden is over and done with and I'm just, I, I'm looking towards my brand new beginning here and I'm just going to go and pursue what I want and pursue what I like. This is a lot of passion. That's a lot of interest, a lot of passion. But again, I'm getting a lot of action. Like I'm going to get what I want. I know what I want. I'm secure. I'm confident. Okay. It's like you're like, you know what, no more being stuck and tied to a connection or to a relationship or to a situation that was just draining you out, okay? The reason for the reading is because now you're finally clear about what you want, the two of swords in reverse here. Either earlier you were unwilling to see a situation for what it was or you were just being very indecisive. You were stuck between a rock and a hard place, stuck between two unpleasant choices, okay? And you were either, again, I'm saying, you were not willing to see the truth or you were just stuck and you wanted to do justice to both the sides or you just didn't know which side would have been the, 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 like, you know, like they say, right? There was no good and bad choice here. There was bad and there was very bad. <laughs> So you had to choose between which is going to be like a lesser bad choice, if that makes sense. And you're finally clear, okay? You see things for what they are. You're seeing the truth. You're getting clarity. In the near future with the Queen of Swords in reverse, you're, uh, 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 someone's not happy that you cut them off. There's someone here who's not happy because you're in the Queen of Wands energy. There's someone who could be an ex. This could be someone who you cut off or your life or they cut you off their life, take it vice versa. But someone's not happy here because you cut them off. They're very bitter. There's someone who's very vengeful, very bitter, okay? This person could just play a lot of games with you, but I feel there's someone who just does not want, does not want to let you go or someone who's just, again, this is a very bad attitude. Someone has a very bad attitude towards you. But you're in your positive energy. You're in a very high vibrational level, okay? And that's what they're not liking because you dropped them, I think. 
you're slowly moving very very slowly and cautiously out okay with the knight of pentacles here okay i'm not getting so much of you're moving towards this person because i think you dropped this person you've let this person go i feel you're more like you're moving towards your stability towards your security you're moving towards your brand new beginning okay this could be with another person this could just be in your finances or in another aspect of your life okay but i think you're just making a very slow move you're not making it very loud okay uh, a very detailed plan is what you have and you're just making sure that things go step by step okay you're not rushing into something in your environment there's someone uh, who feels that you're a risky business okay with a fool in reverse there's someone who has huge trust issues with you okay with the fool in reverse either you have trust issues with them or they do okay this is someone who's gone through hell and back and now could be their past issues which is reflecting on this future um potential this could be a brand new person all over okay that you're dealing with who or probably you're wanting to move towards but this could be someone you know where you ended one chapter and now you're wanting to move towards another person but this person that you're dealing with they're very very cautious okay they just don't feel it's the right time or they just don't feel like taking a leap of faith with you okay with the knight of cups you're in love with this person okay not only are you moving slowly and cautiously towards this person but at the same time with the knight of cups I think you're wanting to offer this person not only stability, but you're wanting to be their knight in shining armor. Okay, you're smitten by this person. You want to sweep this person off their feet. Okay, but the person you're dealing with, no, they're not taking a risk. Maybe this person is going through a lot. Okay, but on your mind, with the Ace of Pentacles, you're in for this. You're in for this commitment. You're in for this stability. Okay, you're wanting to. You, you see this as a brand new beginning. Okay, either in your life or with this person. But you're wanting both stability, security, and emotions. Okay, you're wanting to be vulnerable, wanting to open up with this person. With the three of swords in reverse here, I feel that you're trying to ultimately you're going to try and heal from a breakup, a separation, a divorce, whatever have you. But this is recovery. Okay, this is recovery. You're ultimately going to recover from this heartbreak, separation, or if someone did you dirty, you're recovering from that. You're healing from that. Uh, you're trying to get over the past pain, something that caused you a lot of drama, a lot of emotional trauma and the pain, something that cut you through deep. You're recovering from it, and when you recover from it, this is what's waiting for you. Your race of pentacles is waiting for you. Your gift from the universe is waiting for you. Your manifestation is coming true. So that's what I have for you, Cancer. I hope this reading resonates. Leave your comments below. Like, share, subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.